Yo, it's your boy, R7 Splash. Welcome back to a brand new video. And today I want to discuss something that's been, been widely talked about for the most part. And this is something that I am extremely grateful for. And if you didn't know, Toon Vanguard uploaded a video or he announced something about a tournament a couple of months back. And we all thought, okay, cool. It's probably going to be a normal scrim. You know, you're going to see the same thing. You're going to see Spare Ash with Mind Bank. can be boring. Basically Crucible 2.0, but more sweaty. But last, I think it was a couple of days ago, but he released the rule set for the tournament. And he made the Discord, and there's a ton of people in the Discord. You're probably thinking, well, what's so different about this tournament compared to something like a normal tournament? Or scrims, or practice, whatever you want to call it. So, in this tournament, there's a lot of rules. You can see them on screen right now. There's like stuff like no Aaron Sylph, no Recluse, no Mountain Top, no Mind Benders. Surprisingly as well, no Quick Draw on Precision, I think it's Precision, but it's some shock and you can't get Quick Draw. And I thought it was very interesting because I've been doing scrims now for the past four days and with these rule sets in mind, because I get all these people off the forums and off the, like, the Discord of the True Grant Vanguard made, I'm going to put in the description down below. The people you meet here are actually pretty friendly. Like, don't get me wrong, you get some bad apples. But the actual games you play, like, it's actually fun. You actually see a wide variety of weapons, and I've been really enjoying this. Like, I don't play Crucible, like, the actual Crucible, a lot. But ever since he's announced this, like, tournament coming up, I've been playing a lot more, because the rules actually make the game really fun. Like, don't get me wrong. There's some outliers, okay? Like, I'll point one out right now. But, please, do not abuse this. Don't be a bad apple in this tournament. Let's keep it fun for everyone. So, there's things like, you can run a Dreaded Adventure, a Tatara Gaze, any sort of high-impact sniper. Obviously, you can't put Revoker because it's banned. But any sort of high-impact sniper with the Alchemy, wall hack through the wall within 30 meters, and then you can also put an Empowerment Rift so you can one-hit body. And you're probably thinking, well, hey, you can counter that though if you put five resilience and higher. Okay, cool. Understand. I understand your point. Valid. But what about when I do Ariana's and an Empire Rift? It does 197. This basically means that you need nine resilience and higher to counter this. So basically, you are forced to run nine resilience to counter my loadout. And if you didn't know that, in the scrims, you can't change your loadout. Um, once you get into the qualifiers and once you actually get into it, you can't change your loadout. Meaning if people don't know you're running this, yeah, you can see how unfair it can be. But, these are some outliers. Obviously not everyone's going to run these. I've seen a lot of half downs. I've seen a lot of Outbreak Prime, surprisingly. I see a lot of sidearms. You can see on screen, but there, I got my grenade launcher and my, my sidearm. Like, I never use these in Crucible. But, like, after running a couple of scrims and using these, I'm actually having a lot of fun. Like, and so are the people in the enemy team's fights. They're not raging because they know they're not dying to some bullshit. They're not dying to an Arendelle. They're not dying to a cough map, stompy, crutch, mind bender, ape. You can see where I'm coming from. But yeah, I'm going to go over the positives right now. So the positive of this tournament is obviously it promotes variety. Like, it promotes people using different guns. It's fresh. Like, I did say patch at the moment coming out um, as to making this video, the servers are down, but it's going to be a hard light buff. I'm really interested to see how hard light comes into play. I really am. Like, they're taking away the screen shake, so it could actually be a viable weapon. But, like, in the tournaments, I've seen Skyburners, I've seen <laughs> Cold Hearts, I've seen Prometheus Lens, I've seen so many different types of guns. And the people you meet through this Discord are honestly so awesome. Like, I've probably met at least 10 people already. And, True Vanguard, I've meshed you on Discord. I've added you. Please, Pappy, add me. <laughs> okay, <laughs> putting that aside. But yeah, I really want to say, if you want to have some fun in Crucible right now, doing 2v2s, do this. Honestly, join this tournament. The way you do it... Is I'm going to put a link to True Vanguard's video so he will explain it a little bit better. But you essentially join the Discord and you go to a website that's on TV's link. 
in the description that I can put them down below. If you go on there, you sign up, what happens is next month when he's doing the event, you need one person on your team streaming, and yeah, there's, there's some little bits, you gotta be 18, etc, etc, but honestly, join the Discord, and there's a section that says, um, it's like fine scrims or something like that, it's, it's basically the fine 2v2s and fine matchups, and this is how you practice, and trust me, go for it, it is fun, it is very fun, like you meet a lot of amazing, but like you can see on screen, my friend's running a sweet business, like look at this, you never see these in scrims, but yeah, okay, I'm starting to repeat myself. I'm gonna end the video there. I love you all so, so much. And if you're seeing this from the Discord, I just wanna say that it's, this tournament's really good. Some outliers, but I'm not gonna be negative. I'm not even gonna give some of the secrets away because I don't want people using them. So I'm not gonna tell people. And I'm not gonna run it either because I know it's broken. And I just wanna promote fun in this. You know, the exact intention of this tournament. But yeah, also, thanks to Vanguard for hosting this. It really means a lot. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace. I'm also uh, going in the tournament too. See me in the finals. Okay, bye.